Thousands of students in the Fayette County School District headed back to class today. Take a look at this aerial footage of buses leaving Liberty Elementary School this afternoon. It was also the first day of school for the district's new superintendent, Manny Kalk. Mark Barber shows us how Kalk spent the day connecting with his students. The first day back at school is now in the books for 40,000 students in Fayette County. Many of them got a chance to meet their new superintendent during his first day here. He's had a very busy day making stops at many schools, including Bryan Station High School. The new superintendent is stopping at six schools today to meet with leadership teams and visit classrooms. The Fayette County School Board says his success with an urban school district in Maine helped him get the job here. While the new school leader says he has big ideas about how he can help our students succeed, he says today is just about making a connection with students. He pulled one girl out of class at Bryan Station just to introduce himself because the student's mother spoke so highly of her. The first day back can be exciting or nerve-wracking for students, and he hopes to put them at ease. Cock is making his rounds wearing a tie with graduating students on it. This morning, he wore a backpack and read students his favorite children's book while he rode the bus with them to school. The 43-year-old says it's small moments like this one that lead to truly important teaching moments. The bus was more that sanctuary. Again, it's that first learning environment that we provide as a school district. And so the school bus experience is so important. We had a chance to speak with some of the students who got to meet Cock today, and one of them told us that meeting him made her day. We hope that this has been a great start to what will be a great school year. Mark Barber, the Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. Looks like he had fun on his first day of school. The start of school does mean extra traffic during the morning rush. Police recommend planning an extra 15 minutes into your drive to get your students to school on time.